The use of gasoline and its impact on the environment has been studied at length. It happens to be a major contributor to air pollution. A Scottish biotech company claims to have found a sustainable low-cost alternative, whiskey byproducts, which may just help fuel cars. Take a look at our next report to know how. Climate change is in action. Countries are racing against time to reverse its effects and find more sustainable alternatives. We are way past the point of target setting. There is an urgent need for action. Ahead of the COP26 at the end of this month, a Scottish biotech company is turning whiskey leftovers into chemicals that are used on an everyday basis. With this, there is no need for oil refineries and drilling fossil fuels. Whiskey is made from yeast and barley. The leftovers are called draff and pot ale. Often used as animal feed or disposed of into the sea. And it is this draff that can be used to extract chemicals such as ethanol, methane and butanol through a process called Abe fermentation. So the benefit of this particular fuel is that we're not producing it from petrochemicals. This is made from living carbon essentially. It's from a residues of an industry that's one of the most important industries in the Scottish economy and we can take their residues and turn them into something that we need right now made from sustainable resources. It is being touted as a low-cost sustainable alternative to gasoline that is considered fit for a standard petrol engine. Currently, 50,000 tons of draft can produce about 1 million litres of advanced sustainable biochemicals. If produced on a larger scale, it may just be a viable alternative to petrochemicals. Along with draft and pot ale, this fermentation process can be carried out on other organic waste as well. Bureau Report, We On, World is One.